my channel Sweet Salt Spicy. Today we are going to see a recipe that's made up of banana flour. So I'm making banana flour vada here. First I'll show you how to remove the florets from the banana flour. So once you peel off the first layer of the banana flour, you can see these kind of florets inside. Isn't it amazing? See the beauty of the nature. See, first here we have to remove the black kind of stigma from the flower. You can just see the black stigma which I am removing. And later on we will remove another part that is kind of a plastic as these two are uh, it is not that easy to digest so and it gives a kind of bitterness to the dish so we have to remove this it's compulsory once you remove this I'll show you how to cut the flowers and the procedure has to be followed before preparing the vadas so first remove the, the stigma part and the other a kind of a covering. See, I have removed all the unwanted things. Now, for the recipe, we require around five chilies, green chilies, around one inch of ginger, few garlic pots, and have soaked Bengal gram overnight, around one and a half cup, curry leaves, buttermilk, salt to taste, and finely chopped onions. So these are the ingredients which we require to prepare the vada, banana flour vada. So I have taken a, have taken a blender over here and I am adding the banana uh, Bengal gram to it. And this is optional. If you require this, you can add it. This is the fennel seeds that is soft. Uh, I have added around one, one and a half tablespoon of fennel seeds and I am going to blend it coarsely. Uh, have done it so you can just check the texture of it I have done it coarsely so after this what we are going to do is uh, remove the Bengal gram and transfer it to the other vessel to the same blender I am adding the ginger garlic green chilies green chilies and the curry leaves to it and grind that and add the and add the paste to the bengal gram so now i'll be showing how to cut the banana flour so after removing the stigma and the other part of the banana flour um, we have to cut the uh, flour into small pieces and as soon as you cut into the small pieces, you have to just transfer those pieces into the buttermilk. The purpose of this is uh, to avoid the uh, discoloring of the flour. Uh, if you just keep it uh, without adding to the buttermilk, uh, these flour florets uh, will turn into black. So that's the reason. Uh, and uh, this buttermilk also removes the kind of bitterness, uh, bitter uh, from the flour. So, now I will be transferring the Bengal gram, green chilies, ginger garlic paste, which I had added to the Bengal gram paste uh, to one vessel. And to the same vessel, I will be adding uh, the banana flour, uh, which I had uh, just finely chopped. To the same bowl I'll be adding the finely chopped onions. So here I'll be adding the flour. flour. Uh, so before adding the flour I have to squeeze out the buttermilk from the flour. So you have to do it uh, very tightly so there will be no kind of uh, moisture inside the flour. Chopped finely chopped flour. So this has to be done otherwise your vadas will get uh, 
uh, too soggy and you won't be able to um, put the vadas in shape. So once this is done, you can just add salt, mix thoroughly and shape it into vadas and drop it into the uh, medium hot oil and fry out the very tasty and healthy vadas. You can just try this uh, as an evening snack also as it is very healthy. I have uh, heated a kadai over here. I'll be adding around four and a half to five cups of oil. So we'll be we'll be deep frying the vadas here. So I have added around uh, four and a half to five cups of oil. It's a refined oil. Now I'll just show you how to shape the vadas. Uh, you take a kind of ball, um, any size as you desire and just pat from the middle. You should be very, you should be very gentle while doing this because as soon as you drop the vadas into the hot oil, it might break down. So once you make the balls of the vadas, you have to make it very tightly and gently so that it will be combined in one shape. You can trust me, these vadas uh, were uh, tasted very delicious and it is healthy also. If uh, any of your family members wouldn't like to try this recipe and uh, they won't be knowing that uh, this vadas are made up of from uh, banana flour. So it will look as it is made up of from a Bengal gram vada. So kindly give a try to this snack. If you like this recipe kindly like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.